G'day everyone, welcome back. Hope you're having a great day. It's middle of the week and I've got another video for you. This is a $5 fruit and veggie bag uh, through a church in my local area that I discovered only last week. I went along with a friend again today and I got another $5 bag. So it's fill a bag of fruit and veggies for $5 but there's limits on the individual items. So there's a whole range of things and when you walk through it'll say like one piece of pumpkin or a handful of carrots, something like that, two of this, three of that. So I'll show you all the wonderful goodies I got today. I think again it's pretty good for the five dollars. Uh, slightly different from last week, a few different things this week. So in this week's five dollar produce bag that I picked up you could get firstly two red apples, two nice red delicious apples. And look at this beauty I picked up. This one's ginormous. So that's awesome. Uh, you could get some watermelon again this week. It was one piece of watermelon. But my friend, she actually grows watermelon at home. So she didn't need any more watermelon. And she's given me her piece as well again this week. So that's really nice. So I ended up with two pieces of watermelon. And then you could get two sweet potatoes. They have these nice little sweet potatoes. So I got two sweet potatoes. You're allowed two brown onions. So I got two brown onions and two normal potatoes as well. So they're quite large though. So that's great. And this week they had bags of white seedless grapes, which is fantastic. I haven't had grapes in a, quite a while. So these look lovely. The kids will like them too. So some nice white grapes and you could get, as well as the apples and watermelon, you could get one zucchini or courgette, so picked out this nice courgette, and one Lebanese cucumber. Um, there was one cup of corn you could get, uh, also a bag of green beans, which looks lovely, and one piece of beautiful pumpkin. The pumpkin I got last week I ended up roasting with a bit of garlic salt and along with some potatoes to go with dinner one night. It was delicious. And I found out as well the pumpkin and the watermelon, both of them come from a local farm in the area. And they were actually, the lady was telling us, the lady that organises this, uh, that they were only cut and picked this morning. So basically fresh from the farm. So I thought that was pretty cool. Then you could also get two Granny Smith apples. So all the apples will be great for the kids' lunches. One lime. So that'll be great if I make some sort of uh, spicy curry or something to squeeze over the top, I think, at the end. Maybe even just drink in water. So that's nice. And there was a bunch of bananas. These are Ladyfinger bananas. And these are also local bananas as well. So I think there's about five really nice little ladyfinger bananas and then along with all the fruit and veggies they had at the end of the table so there was a table with different uh, bread items uh, things like nappies on it there was actually toilet paper this week and some drinks i picked up from the table on the end you could get a few biscuits so i picked up three packets of biscuits there's two the same and one a bit different with the chocolate biscuit there and they had these lovely bread rolls again. So I got a six pack of bread rolls. And I also got this week, <laughs> who gives a crap, a roll of toilet paper, which is really helpful. So that's great. And last but not least, I picked up the kids two of these fruity drinks again. These are apple and black currant drinks. So that's everything now that I got in the $5 fruit and veggie bag this week, which I'm really happy with. I think it's pretty good for $5. Don't think I'd be able to get that much stuff from the supermarket for $5. So I think this might be something I keep doing for the next little while anyway, uh, to help out with the food during the week and give us a little bit more variety with the fruit and veggies. Uh, this week I've decided I'm not going to the food pantry on Friday because I still have a fair bit of canned items and I want to use what I've got on hand first a bit. 
So I thought I'd get this $5 fruit and veggie bag during the week and I got some bread on Tuesday. So that should get us through this week with what I've already got at home in the pantry and in the fridge and freezer. So a little bit of a shorter video today, but I thought you'd still like to see regardless what I picked up today and what will be helping us out with food for the rest of the week until next week now. Uh, thanks everyone for watching. I hope you have a lovely weekend. And until next time, take care.